This is my desert terrarium. When I think of a terrarium, I imagine a lush forest and plants. I don't think about the desert. This terrarium has no water, no plants, and no soil. But despite all of that, this terrarium is home to a colony of small bugs called red flower beetles. What keeps this colony alive is the flower that covers the ground. And like the name suggests, the beetles eat the flower. It all started six months ago when I opened the oats in my, in my friend's pantry. It was very bad. A complete infestation in the oats, the flour, and probably other things. Flower beetles are pests, and you should never keep them in a jar for fun. <laughs> I've probably only watered this terrarium twice, and when I did, they didn't seem very interested. I honestly have no idea how they're still alive. They probably get most of the moisture they need from the flower. Since there are no plants in the jar, I have to open it every so often to give them fresh air. It does make me scared doing this because they can fly, and I did show them where my pantry was. The flower beetles go through their whole life cycle in the jar starting out as an egg, then a larva, then to a pupa, and then finally as an adult. This colony has been inside the jar for six months, and I think it's time to move them to something bigger. I have to say, it's been pretty cool watching them go about their day without a care in the world. Food is everywhere, nothing's trying to kill them, it makes me wonder. How would we respond to being in a similar position? If we were put in a world without jobs and without social media, how do you think life would be? Would it be better or worse? I don't know, I've never been in a jar, but maybe one day I will. <laughs>